Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Paulina and in today's video I'm going to share with you my first impression about two testers that I received recently and they are both new releases of 2021. The first one is Libre by Yves Saint Laurent and the second one is Daisy Oh So Intense by Marc Jacobs. If you are interested to hear about these two new releases, please stay with me. I'm going to start with Libre. This is new version of the famous fragrance Libre. And this one is new release of 2021. And this one is Eau de Toilette. The noses behind this fragrance are Anna Flippo and Carlos Benaim. The notes listed here are a little bit different than of the um, original Libre. Um, it is also about jasmine, jasmine tea, um, orange blossom, lavender and white tea, which is uh, distinguishing from the original Libre. What is this fragrance about? I'm going to spray it once again on my wrist. I did already a video about this one in Russian and I think I did a mistake there because I didn't say it was about the white tea and that was the difference uh, to the original one. Um, it is about jasmine, about bitterness of tea, about green tea and about white tea. I can't really detect the differences between these two but this one I think is lighter and fresher and more colorful than the original one and I actually liked it very much and I already ordered this one so in a couple of days I'm going to tell more about this one because this one is really nice and beautiful fragrance. I think it is great for day wear for spring and summer. I like tea I like tea fragrances and I like musky fragrances and the musk note is quite noticeable here. So this combination of tea note and musk, I just couldn't resist. It is a very fresh, light, delightful, colorful, but still very feminine and elegant fragrance, very sophisticated. I think it is great for an uh, office. The projection and sillage are not overwhelming quite intimate and delicate. I like this one and the performance is also very uh, strong. I can feel this fragrance on my skin for hours, on the clothes even longer. I use almost all of this small bottle because I liked it very much. It is indeed a um, nice addition to the Libra family. And the next fragrance I would like to talk about is Daisy by Marc Jacobs, Oh So Intense, another flanker of the Daisy family. And the nose behind this fragrance is famous matte parfumeur Alberto Morillas, who also created the original Daisy. So, intense version of Daisy. I have to say I never particularly like Daisy range and I'm quite skeptical to the fragrances of the Marc Jacobs line but I got this sample and I would like to tell you my opinion about this one. I'm going to spray it on the paper tissue. The notes are quite interesting in this one. The top notes are strawberry, pear and bergamot. The hard notes are honey, jasmine and rose and base, musk, vanilla and oak moss. So what do I feel spraying this? If I'm honest, I don't feel any particular berry or fruity notes here. As it opens, I feel a cucumber very fresh green spring cucumber. It is quite pleasant. It gives um, this freshness and delightfulness to this fragrance. I can detect some bitterness and some um, particular note of oak moss. As it dries down, this fragrance becomes more musky. The musk is here very soft and cottony. 
I quite like this uh, mask here, how they created this fragrance around fresh notes of uh, berries, which I smell as cucumber and musk. I don't feel any particular vanilla notes here and honey. Um, some sweetness uh, some sweetness of honey, but the honey is probably a wild one. It's not overwhelmingly sweet. So overall this daisy, this new daisy is quite a nice perfume for me. A little bit girly, fresh fragrance. I'm a little bit skeptical about this one because the projection and performance are quite weak. I if I'm honest, I don't like the bottles of Daisy. I think it is very girly, but this is my personal taste. So I think I'm not going to buy this um, Daisy, oh so intense. I don't think it is an intense version of Daisy. It is for me very light and fresh and um, airy fragrance. Okay. That was my opinion about these new releases of 2021. This one was success and my new purchase. And this one, Daisy, uh, wasn't really my taste. Okay, I hope you liked this video. Thank you very much for your attention. Please support me through your likes, comments and subscriptions. Thank you very much and see you soon in the next video. Bye bye!